Percentage means out of 100. 1% 1 means 1 out of 100. You can think of this as a fraction, as 1 as the numerator and 100 as the denominator. 10% is 10 out of 100. But notice we can simplify by cancelling those zeros to give us 1 out of 10. This means that to find 1% of an amount, you divide by 100. And to find 10%, we just divide by 10. For example, if I wanted to find 10% of £40, I would just do £40, or 40, divided by 10, which gives me £4. How would I find 20% of £40? Well, I would set it out like this. I would say 10% of £40, and as a shorthand, I like to use an arrow, so 10% of £40 is £4. So to find 20%, we just need to double, because 10% means 10 parts out of 100. So 20% is just double the number of parts. So to get 20% of 40, we would just double 10% of 40, which gives us 8. How would I find 30% of 40? Well, one, one thing we could do is work out 10% which is 4, and then we could multiply by 3, because if I want to go from 10 to 30, I multiply by 3. So multiplying both sides by 3, giving me an answer of 12 pounds. You could also do it like this. You could say 10% is 4, or 10% of 40 pounds is 4, 4 pounds, and then 20% of 4 pounds a 40 pounds, sorry, is 8 pounds, and then you could add them up. You could say 10% plus 20% is 30%, which is going to give you 4 plus 8, which is 12, which gives you the same answer. In these examples, we might need to do a little bit more work. So 10% of 30 pounds, very straightforward. We know that's going to be 30 divided by 10, which is 3. So to find 5% of 30 pounds, we know that 10% of 30 pounds is 3 pounds. 5% is going to be half of this. We're dividing both sides by 2. 3 divided by 2 is 1.5, so 5% of £30 is £1.50. 25% of £30, there are multiple ways you can do this, but we know that 10% is £3, so 10% of £30 is £3. So 20% is going to be £6. We also know that 5% is £1.50. So what we could do is add up 20% and 5%, which would give us an answer of £7.50. You might remember, however, that 25% is a quarter. So we could also do one quarter of £30. And we should also know that this means we divide 30 by 4 and times the answer by 1, which is just 30 divided by 4. 30 divided by 4, 4 into 3 goes 0, remainder 3. 4 into 30 goes 7 times, with remainder 2. 4 into 20 goes 5, which gives us the same answer of £7.50. Let's do some trickier ones. Remember, to find 1%, we divide by 100. So if I wanted to find 32% of 90, we could find 10%, which is going to be 9 kilograms. We could find 1%, which is going to be 90 divided by 100, which is 0 0.9. Or you could just do 10% divided by 10 if you wanted to. 30% is going to be 10% multiplied by 3. 9 threes are 27. If 1% is 0.9, 2% is going to be double that, which is 1.8. We have 30% and 2%. We add them up and we get 32%, which is going to be 28.8. To find 2.5% of 200, it looks a bit tricky, but we could just do 10% which is £20. 5% is going to be half of that, which is £10. 
And then 2.5 is half of 5. So we just need to halve again to get 2.5%, which is £5. To find 12.5% of the same quantity, well, we know 2.5% and we know 10%. So we can just add them up. So we end up with 10% plus 2.5% is 12.5%, which is £25. Here are some questions for you to try. Please have a go at the questions now. Pause the video and when you're ready for the answers, press play. Here are the answers. 